Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Yu-Gi-Oh! GX The Beginning of Destiny. We have a very special episode going on today because it is May 17th, and if you have been checking our schedule the few times I've opened it, uh, today is the first exam. And in order to pass the first- this exam in this game is pretty similar to the exam in the game for G uh, Duel Academy. So, you want to be prepared for it. And in order to prepare for it, I'm going to buy some cards. Normally I wouldn't, but I am right now. I feel like we could use some. Let's see. I won't buy too many, I'm just gonna buy a few. Hey, we got some more traps! Look at that, more eternal memories. Probably because we leveled up uh, last episode. So let's get some of these. Not like I want Final Destiny, but some of these guards cards gotta be good. We'll try to get a Call of the Haunted. And we'll try to get a Premature Burial slash whatever. And then we'll see how it goes. Alright, let's see. We got nothing. We got... Arm Samurai Benkei. I don't know why he's good, but apparently he's good. Alright, new new pack. What do we get in the new pack? Spell Purification. Malice Dispersion. Seismic Shockwave. Ah, Danger Machine Type 6. That's a funny card that Cyrus didn't know the effects of. What a loser. Mystic Plasmic Stone's pretty good. Uh, chain burst and fairy box is broken. It's stupid. I hate it when my opponents have it. Tower of Belleville. Oh, another one. All right. Well, we got some decent cards in that. Uh, I'll I'll leave it at that. I'll keep my two hundred dollars. And uh, I think we'll go take that test. Even though I haven't changed my deck since last episode, even though I really should, <coughs> I think I will. You know what? Screw it. We'll change our deck right now on screen, even though I try to avoid doing on screen changes. Just because it takes a long time due to how the how the system works. But whatever. I gotta remember last episode, there were some good cards I saw. I think like uh Okay, let's uh sort these. Sort by attack first. I wanna get like a Maho Velo in my deck. And then put some equip monsters in my deck. Let's see, what is this? 1500 Maha Velo. Okay, I'll put you in the deck. Even though you're a spellcaster, you'll be fine. And then let's go to our quip spells and put something good in there. Alright. Um, wait, how much how is this do? Oh wait, I also got Nobleman Across Out. That's something I should be paying attention to. Nobleman Across Out is super good. Yeah, no, that's that's it's not banned. Okay, it's limited to one. I can I can use it. Good. Good. Alright, that's what that marker means. I had to learn that the hard way when I figured out Sangam was actually usable. Alright, um... Imperial Rule... Do, 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 do. Just looking at all these other cards to make sure I didn't miss anything too good. Alright, what did I say I was going to put in my deck again? I have completely forgot. Soul Taker, that's... Oh wait, Return to the Doom, sorry. This is Return to the Doom, we're Soul Taker. Discard one monster card from your hand to the grave. Return one monster on your destroyed. Yeah, no. We're, we're Soul Taker. That's the one I'm really thinking about. Uh, here it is. Destroys one face-up monster on your opponent's field. Your opponent receives 1,000 life points. Yeah, this card's broken. I will take it. Alright. Don't need Black Pendant anymore. Oh, I forgot about Mega Morph. That's the, that's the good spell. That's the good one. Uh, that's the good equip spell. This thing can change, change games. Alright, looking at this, we have way too many Spell and Trap cards. I'm done with Shallow Grave, done with Last Will. Uh, Nightmare Steel Cage can stay. Uh, don't need this blade anymore, it's too tiny. Giant True Nades are too good to get rid of. If I'm adding four spells, it's better to get rid of four spells. But the rest of these seem pretty... Oh, I, I'm adding a monster, that's true. So I should get rid of a monster in exchange. Alright, I don't need three familiar knights if I'm being honest. They're not good. They're not good. I just have them because they're warriors and I'm trying to have a warrior based deck, you know? So let's go take our first test of the of the school year. You need to pass three tests to pass the school year, but I don't think the tests actually matter. I don't remember what they do if you pass. I don't remember what they do if you fail. So let's go find out by getting a grade and figuring it out. Because I don't know if I'm going to pass or fail. It's been forever since I've taken this test. I love this game, but I haven't played it in a while. So, classroom. Let's go. First test. Man, this is exciting. So, expect it to be a, a, a like the Yu-Gi-Oh! GX test. 
It just, even if we pass it, we don't get to change dorms. And you can't change dorms in this game, which sucks. Alright, yes, class time. Let's go. This is the first time I'm excited to go to class. To take a test that they did not prepare me for. All they talked about was curry, alchemy, and fucking burgers. I don't need to talk about burgers. I need talking about whatever I'm about to take the test on. Alright, there are two parts. Written and practical. Let's start. Oh, so there's no... Thank God, there's no time duel test. Those were so annoying. So they took out the most annoying part. They only left the two fun parts. The multiple choice and the actual duel itself. What do you call taking cards from your deck? Drawing. Easy. Okay, that's... Okay, that's something they didn't even need to teach us. That was easy. What spell remains on the field after activation? Uh, continuous, residual, continue... Oh my god, this is the easiest test in the world. Question three. T wait, dueling three times to get a winner is called a... Match, I'm guessing? Is that a match? I actually don't know that one. Question four. What is the highest level of Monster Kark at 12? Easy. That's a five god dragon right there. Question five. Limited card. How many copies can you ha have in the deck? If it was semi-limited, it would be two, but a limited card would be one. Yeah. Oh, wait. I think it the limited card was the subject. I think you can have three copies of anything. Damn it. I might have failed that, but that was because they writ the, they writ the question wrong. They writ the question. They wrote the question wrong. I should have said the question was written horribly. All right. And oh my god, it's essential basics. We have to duel the deck that we started with as our test. That is kind of funny. So, is our new deck better than our first deck? An un and it's our unaltered first deck. So that's even funnier. Well, if he goes first, I don't know. Gillian, you and me, we're going to have some words if you pick to go first. I'm going to break that already broken looking nose of yours. Alright, we're back. I haven't dueled this guy since the very first episode. He was the first person I ever dueled. And he was the only duel in the first episode. Which is my bad. I should have put more duels, but still. There's a lot to explore, you know? Alright, I'm going to go with... I could be aggressive, but my monsters aren't great. I'm going to go with Nightmare Penguin in defense mode. Because Nightmare Penguin might actually buff his monsters as well. So it's kind of a risk. And I'm going to end my turn. Because all of his monsters are water. Yep, there's the Jellyfish. Remember when we used that card? Ugh, I never actually used Humanoid Slime. Oh, maybe I did. Maybe just for defense mode. Alright, Nightmare Penguin, you're gonna protect us. I know there's some good traps in that deck because we've had it. That's one of them. That's the one I didn't want to see. That's the only trap that actually mattered in this situation. Alright, well, Nightmare Penguin can't be, it can't be using its effect then. But that's fine, I have a backup plan. Scapegoat. See, I've gotten stronger since the last time we've dueled Gillian. And you've done nothing to change. Even though in our first duel you almost did beat me, which would have been embarrassing as hell. But since you didn't, it's all okay. Alright, you end your turn? Thank you. I needed you to. When this card is destroyed and sent to the graveyard as well to battle, each player can some one monster. I like that. I like that idea. Let's do that. Alright, Familiar Knight, you're going to help me summon a Rocket Warrior. So we both blow up. Let's see if he has a level 4 monster. He does not. He would have summoned it first. Rocket Warrior, get on the field. And then... Oh, he does... Oh, I get to choose. Oh, because I attacked him instead of him attacking me. Well, Mother Grizzly isn't that scary. In fact, the only thing scary was Humanoid Slime in defense mode, so I'm in no trouble. Alright, I'm in no danger. This is not going to be any problems. Come on, man. You're my first test. I expect more from you. Oh, shit. He drew his boss monster. I don't think I could expect anything more than that. But I have traps that actually do things now. I'm sorry, man. Like I said, I've grown. Oh, man. And a strong back row is better than a good front row. So, we win, guys. I don't think he can ever come back from that. He lost his strongest monster. And he should only have one of those in his deck. Like, other than that, only his Orca can beat us. So, yeah. That's a sad duel. Especially, oh, and if I get my Buster Blitter, he can't beat us. Even if he had Amphibian Beast. You, what's your plan, Gillian? It's over, right? That's right. Just set a card. Be sad. That makes me happy. It fuels me. Alright, sadly, I don't have a way of getting rid of these tokens. And I really need to get rid of them. 
Um, you know what? Maybe I'll just attack and maybe he'll have a card that I can work off of. You have a trap card that will help me out here? Oh, just negate attack. Okay, waste a turn. I guess I could have used my guy or my giant true nade, but I, I didn't feel like it. Negate attack isn't even scary. It just waste a turn. And he didn't draw anything. All right. Hey, speaking of wasting a turn, there we go. And let's attack for 25, and then we'll win next turn. So, it took us a little while to beat you, Gillian. You stalled us for a bit. You even got to summon your boss monster. But you can't beat the Busters. The Busters got the bosses that you can't even touch. All right, draw phase. Let's see what you got. Main phase one, Bolt Penguin. That's how you want to end this? Attacking my Sangan? Because like I said, it's over. Even though normally I would let Sangan go, it's over. And I probably should have saved my giant Trunade. It's over. Okay, hey, never mind. There was nothing I needed to save. Oh, I wanted to draw Buster Blader to end it with my boss, but it's fine. I'll just end it the old-fashioned way. No damage done. We are way better than our first deck, and we're on our fourth deck right now. The Warriors. The Bustas. Alright, let's go. I'll call a different deck the Warriors when I actually have a real Warriors deck, because right now I don't have anything. Get a little dual bonus from beating him. Nothing nothing too fancy. Alright, Crowler, are you proud of me? Did I do good? I think you have to wait a day to find out the results, though. It's not like in the other game where they tell you immediately. In this game, they actually take time to grade the tests. Alright, now that we're free to go, we're going to see how we did. Oh no, I think we have to end the- Oh no, it ends the day for us. Good. Alright, let's see the message. I know I messed up on some of those questions, but that's only because they were written weirdly. Crowler, please don't be mad. You got a hunt- No, I didn't! Oh! Wonderful! I'm speechless. Yes, we got 100%. I don't know what that means. I don't know if that's a good or bad thing. But we got 100%. That makes me feel good. Damn, we're smart. We are smart. Hey, Jaden, did you know I'm smart? How'd you do on the test? I want to talk shit to your face. How, how'd you do, buddy? Oh, you're looking for me? Yeah. Oh, I can't do... Okay, well, I'll duel you. You can't avoid a conversation with me if I duel you. Yeah, you have to talk to me during the duel, Jaden. You don't get a choice. I really want to beat you five times, but I'll wait. I'll wait for that. All right, scissors beat scissors. Damn. Oh, okay. Well, he's going to pick pa rock, so I pick paper. Shit, he thought the same thing. Well, then scissors again. Yeah, I got you this time. Okay, he thought he was smart, but I outsmarted him with my smartness. Not, it wasn't just randomly selected. All right, Busters versus New Hero Summon. Eventually, their decks do change, guys. That's why they actually have names for the decks. They change their decks. It's pretty cool. But that's, that's as time passes by. Right now, their decks are going to stay the same. All right, I'll save a Karma Cut in, in case he gets Heavy Storm. Which would be stupid, by the way, so no Heavy Storm. Okay, Fusion Sage, you got me worried there for a second, Jaden. You got a Polymerization now, which also worries me. Oh, Jesus, so he's guaranteed to be able to Fuse. Because all Elements of Heroes, basically, he's going to be Thunder Giant. Oh, he doesn't want to Fuse, he's afraid, he's a coward. You hear me, Jaden? You're a coward. All right, let me just Dust Tornado. See if I can get rid of Sakuretsu armor. Alright, I got rid of Hero Signal. Also good to get rid of, but not what I wanted. Alright, summon Rocket Warrior. Uh, that Sakuretsu armor might be a problem. That's probably Clay Man, so I should attack with Rocket Warrior. And Magic Cylinder. Okay, that sucks, but I mean, I'll take it. And now for the other one, I'm just going to assume it's Clayman and not even, not even touch it. Not even touching this one. You just do you, man. Alright, you ready to use Thunder Giant now? Oh, you just drew it. Okay. So he didn't actually have Sparkman. He just threw Thunder Giant. Alright, now that he's fusion summoned a monster, that's kind of scary. And I can't stop him from using its effect, sadly. Even though I have Karma Cut. Oh wait, but I have Divine Wrath. That can stop it. Alright, no, uh... I really want to summon Buster Blader, but I have to get rid of Karma Cut to do it. Alright, no, none of that bullcrap. Get out of here, Thunder Giant. 
What? Yeah, I know, right? It's crazy. And yes, you still had a monster in your hand after all that. That's crazy. Uh, soul... Oh, it has to be face up, right? Destroy one face up monster. Damn it. Okay, well, that's fine. I'm summoning my boss monster, Jaden. I feel like going balls out against you. Especially since you're beating me. But now you have nothing. Oh! Your last card happened to be Morphing Jar, so you just fit... You get a whole hand? See, this is why the jars are broken. Freaking hell. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Well, at least I have some good cards now, too, but his are probably better. Because he got a whole new hand out of nut. He had nothing, guys. I could have beat him so easily. But the jars are too broken. I wish I had the jars. That's the only reason why I'm mad. If I had the jars, I wouldn't even be mad. Oh, he's gonna get pulverization. Although Thunder Giant wouldn't beat me. He needs something stronger, like Mudball Man. Alright, Thunder Giant's fine. I can take it. Buster Blair's not gonna lose. Exactly, you put him in defense mode. Oh, you have another one of those? God damn. Alright, I'm not gonna Karma Cut him just yet. I will, but not yet. Not yet. Need to hold. Hold back my Karmas. Alright, Mahavelo, get ready to get uh, sacrificed. Alright, Karma Cut. Although, it's probably gonna be Dream Clown, not you. Let's get rid of this. What? And I get to get rid of the one from his graveyard, too. Because Karma Cut also gets rid of any of the same monster in the graveyard. So now I've removed from play two of Thunder Giants. He has to get his third one out for it to matter. Alright. Attack. Thank god. I was going to say, if that's Cyber Jar, I'm going to choke Jaden. I am literally just going to choke him. Because I got some of my best cards this time around. I'm not losing it to a Cyber Jar. The Morphing Jar was bad enough. Alright, what did you get this time? Is that it? Dude, I have a seven tools. You can't beat me. All right, Mahavelo, it's time for you to shine. Now, I don't know if he has another clay man, so we're going to keep attacking with Buster Blader. But, you know. Ah, Avion. God damn it. He's wasting my time. I couldn't have won this turn anyway, but still. I like to do maximize my damage. Yeah, the Berserk Grill is only in our deck still just because it's 2,000 beat stick. We're, we're not, not going to use that. That's too good. Its effect is even that bad. It's only backfired like once against us. Alright, and his trap card doesn't even activate, so it's useless. This this guy's done. This is that was Jaden Yuki, everybody. I want to be your tag partner, Jaden. I want to see if you're any good as a partner. Because as an opponent, you're not doing very good. Unless that card is called a haunted. This no, even if it is, the game's over. He can't do anything. Yep, goodbye, Jaden. You did some good work in the beginning of the duel, but you lost. Aw. Thanks, man. You're awesome, too. Looks like they were going to put voice acting in this game and then just didn't. Damn. I really wish they put voice acting. That would have been cool. Not to say, like, this game doesn't already have a lot of stuff going for it, but I'm just saying... Voice acting does really buff up the the way the way the games play. Makes it way better. And voice actors deserve a good wage, you know? Alright, so let's go. I feel like we've dueled a lot of the same people over and over again. I think we should find someone new. And the best place to look for someone new is at the Raw Yellow Dorm. I don't know why, but we're just going to assume. We lost all, all the Raw We keep losing to Raw Yellow students, so I don't want to lose to the, anyone else, but we got to try. Hello, I'm Rune. Okay, Rune, let's see if I can beat you. Can you please not be that crazy? Because my deck still isn't in a perfect condition. I haven't got the best spells and traps yet. I have some damn good ones like Widespread Ruin. But I still could do better. Alright, scissors. Damn. These raw yellow students, they're good at this. But they even let me go first out of pity. What nice duelists. Invisible hand. What the hell? What does that even mean? What does that even mean? What kind of a deck do you run? Oh, I drew both my Buster Bladers? That's not good. That's not good. I, that, they're, they're, they're not supposed to both pop up. I only need one. Alright, Nightmare Penguin is always a good start, though. Oh, is it a good start when that's all he plays? Alright, he thought that he was going to use his trap to stop me. But no. I gotcha. Alright, now I can summon my Rocket Warrior. 
And we can do as much damage as possible. Remember, Zombrea can't attack directly. That's why I did not summon him. I'm going for direct damage because I want to beat a raw yellow student. I'm tired of losing. We have enough losses on our record. And most of it is from tag duels. If I'm being Honestly, I think half of it exactly, or most of it, is from tag duels. Which sucks because this game is all about tag, tag duels a after a certain point. Like, the re we're doing a lot of single duels now. Once all the once the tag duel tournament starts, you better kiss uh, single duels goodbye because we're done with them. All right, he set a monster and a card this time, so he drew a, a monster card. Too bad I drew cold, cold wave. That's a shame. That's a damn shame, ain't it? All right, Zombra of the Dark, you're gonna take out the monster, and the rest of us will do the work doing damage. Ah, he's gonna get a spell back. Oh wait, there are there's nothing in your graveyard. You've literally done nothing. Okay, this guy I like. I like this raw yellow student. He's not- he's acting like a Slifer Red. Either that or I'm just getting a really broken hand. I feel like I've, I've gotten a broken hand, but still. I like him. I like him weak. I like him scared. I need to stop talking like this because I'm going to get incriminated for something I didn't do. <laughs> Alright, let's see what else we can get. Uh, this guy's good. I would want to summon my boss monster though, if I'm being honest. But I wouldn't win the duel if I did. I'd rather win the duel. Alright, Zombre, you want to end the duel for me? I don't know what that hand card does, but it's over. He tried his best, and he lost. Damn, this guy didn't do anything. We won in seven turns. I hope we get good DP for this. Yeah, that sucks. Poor kid. Another one I lost immediately gets on his knees. You're not that different from Slifer Red, are you? Oh, we didn't get that much. Damn. I was hoping for good money, but no money. Alright. Ojama's just dancing there, laughing at me. Calling me a loser. Don't think I hear you, Ojama Yellow. I hear you. Alright. That was awesome. Yeah, it was awesome. Now I can go buy some more cards. Hooray! That's all I ever wanted to do, was buy more cards, so that's why I keep dueling people. And I buy more cards so I can change my deck up a little bit. Alright, you. Not yet. I'll get a sandwich after. If I have money. Cards are more important. I need cards. I'm now moving on to Raw Yellow students. If I want to move up to the Obelisk Blue level, I need some good cards. Alright, Wave of the Future is open again, but they're, uh... They're expensive. Alright, let's get some more of these. Yeah. That'll do. Some more of these. That'll do. Some more of these. Some more of these. And a blue ice pack, because why not? Alright, let's see what we get today. Dark King of the Abyss. Big Insect. Urby. Portrait Secret, people running about. Damn, nothing good. Alright, Robin Zombie, Mountain, Impenetrable Fortress, Labyrinth Nightmare, Chorus of Sanctuaries. No, thank you. Let's see, Mind's Eye. Ooh, something new there. DNA Transplant, kind of funny, but not what I needed. Mm, mm, Magician of Faith. Meh. It's, it counts as ultra rare, but come on. Or super rare, I don't know what they counted as. Rare Gold Armor, no thank you. I want something better than that. Oh god, I got two of them. Damn. Interesting, interesting. Dimensional Fisher. Metal Reflex Line. That is one hell of a trap card. Alright, I'll admit, that was good. That was a good pull. Wow, two of the final, huh? Body Moon Apophysis. That's not too bad. Yeah, let's let's see that Metal Reflex Line. That's probably, uh, what, an ultra rare? Nope, it's super rare. Okay. And regular rare. Super rare for Magician of Faith. Okay. That's not too bad. Got some good cards today. You know what, guys? I'm going to end it off there. Next time, it will be a very different episode because I will have grinded up by then. And I will hopefully, hopefully have some money so that we can change our deck yet again. Because let's be honest, that's what we're really looking for. New decks, new powers, so that we can do more stuff. Like dueling some of these Obelisk Blue and Raw Yellow students. So... See you all then.